Ayun's team spoke to a number of employers at Otapi to find out whether they will treat the day of elections as a public holiday as it was declared. But that will also depend on how one would translate a public holiday, whether it would mean closing the shops the whole day or half day just like other public holidays. We spoke to big grocery stores, furniture shops, clothing stores and filling stations about the day and with an everyday need, these shops and others are prepared to release their employees but not in the morning hours of the day. Yeah, we are going to operate for the half day from 8 to 1 and there are some people, some staff will be off for the day and those working up to 1 o'clock will be given chance from 1 o'clock to go cast the bus. We are going to trade half day from 8 to 1. We are going to work a half day from 9 to, uh, to 1, then we close, then we go for voting. However, filling stations will remain open 24 hours, but all workers will be given a chance to go and vote by means of their shifts. In all distant days, the people of Monsati will go to the polls and said they are more than ready, including the first-time voters. It will be my first time, and I'm ready to go and vote. I'm ready to go and vote and I know how to use the machine very well. I now know how to use the machine very well, and I'm going to vote. For a town that is known for its vibrant and high level of political activities, Otapi has been keeping a low profile, but perhaps with each one in their own way preparing for the upcoming elections. For NBC News, I am Langhe